Welcome to North. The coal mining in this, but everything changed. As you can see, this village is a casualty of progress. I look forward to seeing the new discoveries you make in your travels. Share in her rage. Take us all the way to the salsa. Hey, you can't let those assholes talk to you like that. We should go back and beat them up or something. Practically, the whole damn town came out to crap on him. Someone tell me why I'm the only one who's pissed here. Tell us what it was all about. They were talking like you sold them out for money, but 
I know that isn't true. That's not you. So how'd they get it so wrong? Where the hell is it? This about her? About Marlene? Decent place with decent coal. Decent folks, too. Rough around the edges, but big hearts. Salt of the earth. And I sold them all down the river. Took away their future and their hope. Sud and porous dirt, but none of that mattered. We had friends and family, and that was enough. Till we learned about the miracle of Mako and all we'd been missing out on. And then we just had to have a taste. <laughs> so now only dying is opposed. Damn right I am. We can't just abandon the mines. Not after our fathers and grandfathers risked their lives to maintain them. I hear you, Dine. I do. But nobody sees any future in coal. So I ask you, why break our backs working harder and harder when we're taking home less year after year? <sighs> if I may, sir. Once the reactor is complete, a portion of the revenue will go to the town. Your community will be preserved, or enriched, I should say. Listen, man. This is your chance to give your daughter a better life than what we have. You think I haven't thought about that? Come on. Are we gonna let some city slickers tell us our coal is worthless? We gonna let them tell us we're worthless? It would seem we've reached an impasse. In which case, any further discussion would be a waste of breath. So, Mr. Mayor, shall we put it to a vote? Ecstatic. Convinced it was the dawn of a new era. Then one day... <clears throat> the reactor exploded. Y'all saw the aftermath. I push for the reactor. 
I put us on the path that brought us here. Barrett. The saucer's waiting. Lockhart and Cloud Strife. Look at them. Look! Waltzing around with the flower seller and Hojo's lab rat. Who are these people? At least they're finally on a real wanted list. It's about time. That's all well and good. But why am I in charge of handing out the posters? Don't they know I have a division to run? I think you're where the president wants you. Cloud, the others are waiting. All 
our scheduled flights are currently full. We apologize for the inconvenience. a challenge, we must rise to meet it. Are you ready to rumble? You can do this, Cloud.
Give our worthy contender another thunderous round of applause! token of my thanks. <sighs> One golden ticket. Your ticket to paradise. <laughs> cool. <laughs>
should lie down for a bit. No. I'm all right. Come on, man. I know this ain't to see. Why don't you and me go book us some more? Well, the four of us are off. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Get some sleep, okay? Hmm, let's see. The hotel's gotta be. to clear those somber skies. Whether it be dark or bright, I'll read your future right. Just let me go shoot in the messenger, eh? There's some kind of toy. Yoo-hoo, lads! Eyes up here. Huh. Okay, Seth, fortune teller extraordinaire. Put it there. Huh. It's a toy, all right. Pretty lifelike, though. Come on, pal. Give us a smile. The Gold Saucer's meant to be a happy place filled with happy people, don't you know? So show us those pearly whites. Back off.
tacky and understaffed. Great. Hello? <laughs> Welcome, gentle sirs. What in the hell was that? <laughs> My most sincere apologies. <sighs> Got any rooms? There's six of us all told. Well, five and one pet. Hmm. Might I inquire as to what kind of pet? Uh, he was joking. Make it six. Very well. Now then... Hmm. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, gentlemen, but it appears we're all booked up for the night. <sighs> for crying out loud. What about the other hotels? Forgive me, sir. But according to my records, all of our hotels are sadly fully booked. What? <laughs> Hello again. Nowhere to stay? And what's it to you? Now then, did you want one sweet or two? Ah, you trying to scam us? I wouldn't need dream of such a thing. And to prove it, I'll foot the entire bill myself. Sure you will. Well, aren't we a prickly bunch? You there, dangly man. Would you mind checking one more time? Hmm? Hmm. Oh, a timely cancellation! <laughs> the Tonberry and Elagor suites have just become available. Shall I book them for you? <laughs> it feels so good to do good! All right, lads, enjoy your stay! <laughs> Toodaloo! Your suites are on the fourth floor. Please, proceed to the elevator at the top of the stairs. Hmm. 